One Piece episode 1005. We took a two week break, so we're here with episode 1005 and it is titled The Power of Ice Oni, a new version of the playgrounds. So they're finally gonna go into depth about the rounds that Drake was talking about when he said, We'll see how they figure that out. Luffy's still not at the rooftop, so I'm waiting for that. And we didn't necessarily see how the fight ended between Kaido and the Scabbards. That last strike, the Odin Togen Totska, after that, we got a straight up to be continued. So I am curious to see how that damaged Kaido if it did anything at all. Again, I'm not sold he lost. I don't think anyone is, but we'll just have to see what happens as we watch that episode. Episode 1005 of One Piece. Let the reaction commence. Is he still up? Oh, it opened back up. The wound, oh my God. That noise. <laughs> you know that hurts. CGI. Kaido falls. How does that work? Cause he done lost a lot of blood if he wasn't his regular size. Like like if he was in his regular form. I don't know. Damn, that was kinda intense. It just showed the man drop. Yeah, Queen is a problem. Even without fighting. The fact that he can come up with all of this stuff. It reminds me of that one scientist from Punk Hazard, whose name I can't remember. But he's Frieza's voice actor. There we go. The playground. Oh my god. See, that's the thing about Queen. Like, Queen as a character, strength is in his designs. Even with the Devil Fruit, he's super strong, but like, he can control, not control, but yeah, basically, no, he can control Drake as long as he shoots him with one of those bullets. Which isn't gonna happen. But in theory, he could. So what if he shot Kaido with it? Or is there like a limit? That's what I've been thinking of. Uh... Yeah, don't touch him. It's a good thing we got Chopper here. Cause Zoro would have literally just been lost actually. Okay, so maybe Chopper may find a way to turn them back if they're going the route of like not injuring them Because I thought like once they turned it was over Yeah, there is an antidote Queen's not taking that risk. What's the chance that one of them comes up there and tries to bite him, right? Or maybe he's immune That was a clean transition Right. Good job, Sonny. I like his theme for Wano. It's really groovy. Oh my god. Is that his devil fruit? <laughs> now that's crazy. His arm is a gorilla. <laughs> gorilla punch punch. <laughs> now that's wacky. <laughs> oh, this funny. Kind of fast though. Okay, Epo. Appreciate you, Jim Bay. Come in and clutch. Don't let Luffy have to deal with this goofy looking dude. Yeah, I'm glad Jim is a part of the Straw Hats now. Oop. <laughs> okay, I guess that's that. Now you're gonna get up. You're gonna get up. Okay. Oh, that really sucks that the girl has a mind of his own. Because then you gotta carry her on dead weight on your arm. <laughs> when he's hungry, 
Where does he poop? I mean, like, after he eats, not when he's hungry. Oh. Oh, it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, Jinbei's not letting you do that. Right? Right? You better stop sleeping on this, man. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> he's so clean. Because he's like quietly strong. He's not in your face. But if you imagine with him, Jinbei will knock you out. Now you really got one shot. That's crazy. And not because you got mad that two people are arguing. Isn't that beautiful? To have a smart man on your ship. Okay, so I switch your roles. Big Mama Marco? Oh, no. It's just a festival. I wonder what they're doing. And they don't even realize a war is going on right now. It's okay to have hope like that. And in a way, he did. Does that really happen? Oh my god. Yo, these designs. That would make me so uncomfortable. <laughs> So goofy, man. おお、来たか。飲みね、飲みね。本当。いいね。火祭りは。え、まるで昔に戻ったようです。昔か、月焼き様が健在で、破天荒なお伝様がいたあの花の都。戻れるといいな。You gotta change one off of people like that. And people like this too. Who have no choice. Oh, they don't know Orochi's dead. A lot of stuff is changing by the end of this night. And this festival will be a new beginning for them. It's beautiful. Now again, I don't think Kaido's dying in this arc at all. So I don't know how this is going to end. But I do believe Wano will have a good future by the end of this arc. Maybe he just gets. Like, uh, I don't need it no more. Wow. He just let blood sit there and drip. He's going to get back up, but that's a lot of blood lost. <laughs> don't say that. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. Y'all ready for death, right? Well, okay, they have faith in Odin. <laughs> Guys. No surprise attack, please. <laughs> They're still in Sulong form. That is crazy. Megalomushi and Inorashi are monsters. Literally, but monsters. Thank you, Ashura. Good idea. Although, don't get too close to Kaido, you know? But yeah, be fearless. Woo! There you go. Damn. Don't lose hope yet, you guys. This man is upside down. Kaido and Odin. That, that, oh my gosh. Literally somebody that dies, not even what, a week later? Changed Odin's fate. That witch. And Kaido couldn't stand it. <laughs> 
Because they didn't kill you? Oh, that symbolism. I wouldn't be too sure. There's a man on this island that wields Enma. You guys be careful. Talking like that. Oh, God. The blast breath again? Tornado breath? Ooh, Kiku. Ooh, her arm. What? Damn. Oh, this is not the One Piece style. Okay, Kiku just lost that arm. I mean, we've seen people survive with their arms getting cut off. But uh, Luffy needs to hurry up. Because they done did all they can do. They reopened his wound. You know, dealt their little combinations and damage. And at this point, it's like, you know, how far is the rooftop from where they were just at? I enjoyed this episode. Ending leaves me a little skeptical. Like, is Kiku gonna die? She's a good character. And it wouldn't be okay to wrap her up that way since she took care of Kanjiro. Yeah, I think she did. I think Kanjiro's... I'm not gonna say he's dead, but that was a really cool way that she was the one that took out Kanjiro in that last strike. In the end, I'd rather she stays alive. I know I can't really wish for that when we're fighting in Onigashima. It's not that often that One Piece gets this bloody. I saw Kaido get his wound open, it literally dripped out, and then her arm. But yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy this reaction. All the way to the end, if you made it here, I appreciate you.